Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have been tagged to answer 40 questions. Uh, it's called the 40 Question Challenge and I have been tagged by my fellow YouTube creator here uh, by the name of Vonda C. And I will link her, um, her challenge video in the description below. So let's get started. This is a big challenge. Okay, so it's 40 questions. I have written them down and I will answer them for you. Do you like blue cheese? Absolutely, especially when I go out to eat. I always order it from, on my salad. Coke or Pepsi? Well, I was a Coke lover for many, many years, but when I switched over to diet, the Diet Coke just wasn't good enough for me because I expected it to taste like Coke, so I switched over to Diet Pepsi. Are you in a relationship? Yes, I am with all Zeus Phillips, and y'all know about that. Do you drink alcohol? Yes, I do occasionally. It's not anything that I keep in my home, but um, if I go out to eat, I will order, um, it depends. If it's Mexican food, I will usually order a margarita or a Corona. Uh, other than that, I, I really don't drink much alcohol. Hot dogs or cheeseburger? Oh, hot dogs for this Southern girl with chili. My favorite food is Mexican food. I especially love enchiladas. And I really love Mexican street food when I'm in Mexico. What do you drink in the morning? Well, I drink coffee, and now I'm drinking it midday because this is part of my um, intermittent fasting. It keeps me filled up throughout the day. Can you do 100 push-ups? No, that's a dumb question. <laughs> My favorite season is autumn. I love the changing of the leaves and the crispiness in the air. My favorite hobby is um, arts and crafts. I love making wreaths and just making pretty things. Any tattoos? No, and I don't plan on getting any. Do you wear glasses? Yes, I do. Phobias or fears? Ooh, my biggest fear would be losing another child. Uh, my nickname is Glenda Merle. My favorite candy is Snickers. Do you believe in ghosts? Absolutely not. Rain or snow? Well, I think a light snowfall is beautiful as long as I don't have to shovel it. Uh, piercings, yes, just one in each year. Uh, what's your age? I'm 69. Fries or onion rings? Um, I love onion rings if they're crispy and delicious. Uh, do you have kids? Yes, I have three kids, two boys and a girl. My favorite color is coral. Uh, can you sing? Um, well, not too good, but I do try. Can you whistle? <laughs> a little bit. Where were you born? I was born in Poplarville, Mississippi. Do you have siblings? Yes, I have an older brother, Malcolm. Uh, he is deceased, and then I have an older sister, Angela, and Bobby. Can you cook? Absolutely. I'm an amazing southern cook. Can you swim? Yes, I'm a very good swimmer. And I learned to swim on my own just by jumping into the pool there in Lumberton and uh, going to Little Black Creek and just swimming. Are you religious? Yes, I am a born-again Christian, and I have been since I was about 12 years old. Shower or bath? Uh, a good hot shower. Uh, city or nature? Well, I love being out in the nature. Um, you know, I love the woods and the smell and walking among the trees and especially the pine trees and the scent. But I like living in the city. I like being near the grocery store and uh, near the shopping areas. And uh, I just like the convenience of the city. Or, are you a good friend? Yes, I'm a very good friend. I listen well, and I try to be um, loving and accommodating to my friends. Uh, broken bones? Yes, I've had, um, I broke my right ankle in a bad car crash, and I um, broke all three bones. How many TVs do you own? Just the one that's up here on the wall. Worst pain ever. That was, um, getting the news that my son Jeremy had been killed in a car crash. Do you like to dance? Oh yes, I love to dance. Do you like camping or fishing? I've never been camping. I don't think that I would be happy camping. I like uh, comfort 
Uh, so I would have to choose fishing. Are you weird? Um, no, I don't think I'm weird. I think I'm normal. Where would you live if you could? Mm, I'd probably go back to East Tennessee. I love the Four Seasons and just I just love that area. Knoxville specifically. Uh, yeah, that's only 39, so which one did I miss? <laughs> Vonda, you'll have to let me know which question I missed. So let's see, who do I want to tag? Um, I want to tag Melina Brock. Let's uh, find out 40 things about you, Melina. And I will also um, leave Melina's channel linked in the description below. We already know that Melina is an excellent cook, so uh, we don't even have to have you answer that question, do we? But I'm really enjoying all of my birthday gifts. I do have a few more to open, so I will be doing that as the week progresses. Um, I am actually making this video before my cataract surgery on my right eye because I'm trying to get some videos made up ahead of time. Um, I do have to babysit a few days this week also. Um, you know, work, work schedules and babysitting, they don't always take a, a vacation or take a sick leave when us women do. Um, that's one thing about being a mother and a grandmother. Um, sick days and vacation days are hard to come by. I know when I was raising my family, I, I very seldom got to take a sick day. So I'm just enjoying my bulletproof coffee here today. I hope that you will brew yourself a cup of coffee and just sit back and relax and just enjoy life. You know, sometimes we just get so busy and wrapped up with working and cooking and shopping and uh, going to doctor appointments and doing all the, the um, things in life that we have to do on a daily basis that we forget to just sit back and brew ourselves a cup of coffee and enjoy life. I have been enjoying the iced coffee, so I do want to thank uh, Susan Scott for introducing me to iced coffee. I don't think I would have even thought about ever having um, ice in my coffee, being from the South, you know, back when I grew up in the South and was raising my family there in uh, Louisiana. I just always drank the hot coffee, so... Um, I'm really starting to like the iced coffee, so I want to thank my subscriber who works at McDonald's for telling me to order the unsweet vanilla iced coffee the next time, so I will do that the next time I go. Um, the McDonald's here is a little bit out of the way, so I've still been going to the Dunkin' Donuts to get my iced coffee, but I did order the unsweet iced vanilla coffee the other day, and it was delicious. I did get the four packs of Splenda, and I put that in it. And that's exactly what I have in my hot coffee today, is four packs of Splenda, um, a dollop of real butter, and a dollop of um, coconut oil, and then my four Splenda in it. You can see the butter and the coconut oil in it. It is so delicious. It's so funny how, how you remember certain things about places that you go, but I remember being in Disney World. I was in Epcot Center. You know, I used to live in Orlando, and I did go to Epcot frequently. I really love Epcot more than I do Disney World, but I remember being at a concession stand and ordering me a Coke, and this lady came up and ordered coffee. <laughs> Y'all, she asked for 25 packs of Splenda to be put in that cup of coffee. I nearly fell over. Of all the things for me to remember about Epcot Center, that one thing has stuck in my head. So I just want to thank you for being here today and listening to my 40 question challenge and my answers. Y'all, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. And y'all just keep on coming back. Bye, guys.